With the growing number of startups in Bangalore today, it has become imperative for startups not only to learn about the ecosystem, but also learn more about business models and gain good mentorship. It was with this idea in mind that Axelor was started. The sheer number of startups that are coming up, right? It is important for us to have a lot more communities and uh, having hubs in different parts of uh, Bangalore, which is a thriving community for uh, startups, uh, is a good thing to do. And uh, JP Nagar, contrary to popular perception, is uh, a thriving uh, startup hub, right? Uh, even in Axelot's own experience, in the last three months, we, we have had more than 15 events going here. So, and it has all the things that are required for entrepreneurs in terms of uh, support systems, in terms of whatever they will need. Startup uh, ecosystem, as I think everybody knows, has evolved quite dramatically, is growing very, very fast. And as a critical ingredient of the startup ecosystem, we need uh, incubators and accelerators. An accelerator takes off from where an incubator ends and helps develop the growth strategy, the growth plan uh, for the company. We set up Axelor with a clear vision uh, to improve the odds of success of entrepreneurs in the first 24 months. While in the last one year we have had uh, progress in terms of the sheer number of founders we have supported and the startups we have supported, so we have been able to, through these three programs, uh, been able to support more than 24 startups and 52 founders. So Vidar is an online SaaS platform for businesses to uh, better understand the voice of their customer. So uh, Axlor, because uh, Axlor is teaming with a lot of people who are really, really experienced industrialists and investors and mentors. So uh, our uh, basic uh, need from Axlor would be that after the 100 day program, we'll be better equipped with uh, exactly what our customer, uh, who our customer is, what our market is and be able to uh, get a few paid customers onto our platform. You know, what's very important is these are all long-term commitments. So one has to really stay, see what kind of long-term commitment corporations will have to this whole effort, um, how committed they are uh, to actually working with young interesting companies because you need patience, you need corporate commitment but overall net net if I were to kind of uh, um, give my sense of it, I'd say it's a very positive development certainly. Actually, what we noticed is that our last three investments were teams that started in Gurgaon at Investopad and one in Delhi, and then they moved down to Bangalore to search for more talent. You know, I think the uh, uh, UID was a project which I had written about in my book, Imagining India in 2008. And parallelly, the government had been working on creating a UID authority and that got cabinet approval in 2009 January.